how are you in today's video i'm going to show you how you can uh, root huawei y6 pro tit al00 which is running uh, latest version of uh, firmware let's start your first thing is you need to enable oem unlock in developer options developer options can be enabled uh, by tapping seven times on uh, your build number build number can be found in about phone which i have already enabled as you can see in developer options in developer options uh, you will see i have enabled oem unlock and uh, usb debugging is also enabled this is the most important thing next thing is open your uh, adb tool the link download link you can find in the description of this video type adb devices the your device will be shown in the list if it is not shown you can uh, allow the adb access uh, on your phone screen after that type adb reboot dash bootloader and press enter your phone should reboot into uh, fast boot mode as you can see phone has just booted to the fast boot mode you will see the small uh, letters uh, in the left bottom of your phone screen now you can uh, unlock the bootloader of your, your uh, phone type the command fast boot oem unlock and then type your uh, bootloader unlock code which i have already generated from uh, huawei website the complete process uh, of uh, getting bootloader unlock you can find on uh, the website okay when i enter the code on your phone screen it will ask uh, you want to unlock the bootloader or uh, not so volume up a uh, volume up is yes and volume down is no i will press the volume up i think the button is little hard so i will try to press it with little more force uh okay it is selected yes and uh, now uh, my phone will go in a uh, boot mode the selection uh, list from here you need to select the normal um, uh, boot and uh, this message will appear on your screen that means you have successfully unlocked your bootloader and uh, after that uh, your uh, phone should reboot and uh, it will factory reset so i suggest you to make a backup of your uh, all important data because you will lose everything on your uh, phone memory okay the phone is just uh, now booting up okay as you can see the phone set to factory settings now i will make the initial settings you don't need to set the any uh, security on uh, security code okay once phone booted connect with the your pc and uh, run the adb tool now we are going to flash uh, twrp recovery on uh, our device i think the device is not detected uh, i will just restart my pc we was uh, you need to remember at this point you need uh, you also need to copy all the root files which is a bo patched boot Uh, image and uh, super su file you need to copy both these files in your phone memory okay now i will re uh, reboot my device to bootloader mode again because we can only flash twrp recovery in fast boot mode okay the phone has just booted to fast boot mode and uh, now we will flash the twrp recovery type fast boot flash recovery space the twrp recovery name is uh, i think twrp3 enjoy 5.image yes and press enter it will start flashing uh, the twrp recovery on your phone you will see the following uh, uh, messages on your screen if the installation the flashing is successful now you need to force reboot your phone you can also remove the battery and uh, insert back to boot up your phone or just 
hold volume down and power for 30 seconds and uh, this will force your phone to reboot okay the phone has just rebooted I will try to go into TWRP recovery I will just keep holding my volume up button maybe it, it will allow me to enter the TWRP recovery mode mm, I think no I have to use the ADB commands uh, to enter TWRP recovery okay let's wait until it boots up completely then I will show you how which type uh, which commands you need to type okay in ADB tool again we will type uh, ADB reboot uh, recovery and press enter and uh, the phone should enter TWRP mode as you can see the phone just booted and yes it entered uh, in TWRP mode in TWRP recovery we need to uh, press on uh, install button and uh, then select uh, image install image button and I have copied all the root files uh, in my SD card so I will select uh, storage as uh, SD card and uh, then I will select this boot image boot 108 uh, root image and uh, I will replace it with the, the stock boot image and uh, flash okay the flash has been completed and uh, now I will go back and now it's time to flash the super SU I will select install zip and then select uh, super su file which i have already copied to my sd card and swipe to confirm the flash it will take uh, 10 to 20 seconds to flash the super su as you can see the flashing has been successful now only thing left is reboot your uh, phone to system i will just press the reboot uh, system button and uh, the phone should start up the phone just booted up so we will see if any unusual thing happens okay it is uh, optimizing uh, applications so it is going to take another 10 minutes I have skipped uh, uh, this uh, process so just to save the time as you can say uh, it is uh, as you can see it is about to complete okay the phone is ready now I will uh, install uh, the root checker to make sure uh, that uh, the root access has been gained successfully the super SU application is working fine now I will install the root checker okay root checker is installed now I will open it and verify root access okay accept the disclaimer agree and uh, okay now tap on verify root okay grant the root access and yes your device has been successfully rooted Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel.